The Bills' strength at tight end? Big playability. This starts with Dalton Kincaid, who Bills fans hope was only scratching the surface of what he can do before and after the catch. But Dawson Knox has proven plenty capable of chunk catches and making tacklers miss. Even Quentin Morris with 10 career catches has produced seven first downs and two scores. And I'm excited to watch 6'7 Zach Davidson at camp after an eye-opening spring. Weakness? Blocking. This is mostly a Kincaid item. He is likely to play the most snaps next year. Late in his rookie season, he did improve, mainly because getting worse would have been difficult. Knox is decent, but not spectacular. Morris is just average. There is a reason why the Bills play a healthy dose of formations with an extra offensive lineman. X Factor, the year two jump. Kincaid had a solid rookie season, but as a first round pick that was traded up for, more is expected and certainly hoped. His route tree expanded the latter part of last year. More intermediate and deep shots. The natural progression of a young player should mean more production. But is Kincaid just a dependable plus tight end? Or is he an elite top three dominant pass catcher? Anything from one end of the spectrum to the other seems reasonable.